Hey guys, I'm coming to you from the Emirates plane. This is the A380. I'll show you the flight safety instructions, A380. We just had lunch and I'm flying from JFK to Dubai. I have a quick layover in Dubai airport and then I'm headed for my final destination to Manila, Philippines. And I wanted to take you shopping with me. I filmed a separate video shopping kind of a tour of the JFK terminal for the international terminal and unfortunately I didn't really like do my research because the terminal 4 didn't have these stores <laughs> the um, Hermes and Cartier and Dior stores are in terminal 1 so I wasn't able to visit those so I've already done shopping a little bit of shopping at the JFK airport duty-free shopping this is my first time flying Emirates, and what's really cool is they have, like, I've heard of Sky Mall, but Emirates has, like, a separate thing, and I thought I would take you along shopping with me because I think I'm going to be buying stuff from here, and they deliver to you on board. So let's go ahead and take a look at their Emirates magazine. All right, so here's the Emirates magazine. It's called Ice, Information, Connectivity, and Entertainment. Um, that's also the kind of, like, navigation screen on board. I'm watching the movie Smile. Um, it's an interesting movie, but... Okay, oh, also real quick. So they give you a little pouch. This is a really nice pouch. I flew Philippine Airlines Economy last time I went to the Philippines direct, and it was a nice, cute little change purse bag. Then I flew business on the way back, and it was a furla bag. So I'm flying Economy on this trip. Oh, and by the way, I'm glad I'm flying Economy. I almost upgraded to Emirates business class, which was initially 1500 to upgrade. And then at the gate, it was 1900 to upgrade. And I chose not to, and they actually were very nice. This flight is not that busy. There are a lot of empty seats. And they actually booked my entire row. Uh, like I have the entire row <laughs> to myself. So I already took a little bit of a nap. I have three pillows, three blankets, my carry-on bags. I was, able to, I was able to put underneath my chairs in front of me. I'm flying with my mom. She has two rows behind me, also with her own row. So let me show you what's inside this little pouch. So the pouch has the little Emirates zipper pull. This is made of a little recyclable material. Oh, this was not part of it. <laughs> We just had lunch, so I stuck the breadsticks and the little chocolate inside here. But what came in here is a mask. We have a little sleeping mask, very thin. We have this little bookmark in Arabic and in English. It talks about the four elements and that they are trying to be sustainable. Four elements right there. So a nice bookmark, a mini toothpaste, a cute toothbrush. It looks wooden. It says Emirates. We also got a pair of socks and I'm already wearing it, <laughs> but they're very comfortable socks. So in this plastic sleeve, we have an envelope. If you want to donate to their charity foundation, we have an air sick or trash bag. And here is this very exciting magazine that talks about their in-flight entertainment and some online shopping. So it's similar to duty free shopping at the airport, but they deliver it to your seats and they have some promos going on. So for example, I just bought two perfumes at the JFK airport, but if you buy two perfumes here, you save $15 and then other items you can save up to 15% off. So I flipped through it and it's, it's I will be shopping here. I read, my mom already wants some stuff, so I'm going to <laughs> order some stuff. Um, I think once they're done serving food and everything and snacks, they're going to go around and have a duty-free person come around and take your order. Here's a little teaser of what they offer. They have the prices in US and um, AED. There's a little mini bottle of champagne, $20 US. Um, so we have all the in-flight entertainment. And then all the shopping. Oh, Emirates Red. So that's the website. You go to Emirates Red, and then they have a promo code to save 10% off your first order. So the first few pages are just all the shows that they are offering to play on the screen. Let's flip through it. Skip, skip, skip. 
and some of it in Arabic. If you're staying in Dubai for a while, which unfortunately this trip, I'm not staying. We don't even have a long enough layover to really even go fully duty free shopping. But if you were to stay, they have some offers, um, lounge access, and okay, this is the Wi Fi plan. They had some like tourism stuff, charters. Here is their retail store. And I already spoke to the flight attendant. They have pretty much everything here they have in store. So they will literally bring it to you right away. <laughs> the fragrances, I don't know if they'll have the testers. So, oh yeah, see, tax-free shopping delivered straight to your seat. Shopping with Emirates is now easier than ever. So you go to the website. Unfortunately, for some reason, I can't access it on my phone, but you can pre-order, you save 10%. You can even pre-order before your flight. Wish I knew that I would have researched ahead of time. This looks really nice, I like Queen's bag. Oh, this one was a great deal, uh, the value. So I'll, let me go forward, okay. Here's the new, I think this is new. It's the new Creed fragrance, Windflower. And I wish they had a uh, fragrance sample. Like, I wish you could smell it, you know? They don't have that, although this is really hard. That would have been helpful. I wish I could smell that. I love Creed. I don't own any Creed, just the samples. But they are, uh, if you're interested in Creed, they are included in the buy two, say $15. Ella um, K, I I don't know this one. Okay. Oh, and here they talk about the plane. This plane is gigantic. It's two levels, first class and business, I'm guessing is up here. I'm flying economy, and the first few seats are uh, comfort economy, I think. And they have some Emirates merch. Both prices. Really cute, cute stuff if you love Emirates, I guess. Um, okay. Cute little. Oh, they look like the flight attendants. That's so cute. That's cute. Oh, here are the experiences. So. You can go sightseeing if you're going around town. And then I think these pick you up from the airport. Aquaventure Water Park. Um, oh, that's right. They have skiing. Like, it's an indoor skiing, right? Snow Park. I've always heard they have indoor skiing here. I've never experienced it. Okay, here, top of the Burj Khalifa. Pretty good. $60 or 59 USD. Dubai Theme Park. Wow. One day I'll come back. Uh, do a whole sightseeing over here. Okay, here we have watches. So there's a bunch of watches. I am actually not familiar with many of these brands, but if you like watches, here are the prices. This is like a Tiffany blue color, whatever that is. Zinvio. Zinvio. I've never heard of this brand. Is it good? I don't know. Cerruti. This is a set. Comes with a cable bracelet. Okay. Ladies Watch, 269. Uh, Agner, is that how it's pronounced? Okay, I love the two tone. And, oh, Michael Kors, 262. That seems pricey <laughs> for Michael Kors, I don't know. Okay, more, oh, Maserati. Who knew Maserati has watches? That is cool. I like the blue. This is 246 USD. Another one. Canada the Cole. Oh, here's another promo. If you pre order, you save 10% if you use the code RED10 when you order online. Uh, okay. So I'll talk to the duty free person when they come around because I'm going to be ordering some stuff. Not watches, but here's more options. D1 Milano. I've never heard of these brands. More fashion watches, prices 180. Casual gents watch 151. Okay, Gant watch and card holder set. Okay, 176. I actually really like the colors of this. And then a card holder. Card holder. And Klein jeweled wonders. Dress watch 148 for this. And then we have this interesting ladies' charm watch 173. 
I don't know. I'm not really a fan of this style. Oh, yeah, I hate it. I mean, maybe if the watch part was in here and then you had charms hanging off, but, you know, you're trying to get the time and it's like jingling, jangling all over your bracelet. Okay. Aviator, 154. Uh, oh, my God. <laughs> $29 for this. That is so interesting. That actually... I think my son would like that. I have my 12-year-old. Huh, interesting. $29, okay. Allure watch and double bangle set. Rose gold, 90. Fiero, never heard of that brand. Okay, and here we have fragrances. So this is what I think is the newest House of Creed wind flowers. Now, I'm not familiar with the pricing of this. Creed is very expensive, but you have to double check the price. So once I have internet access, I don't know, I guess I'll double check. So 309 seems comparable to other Creed fragrances. And then AED is 1125. I'm not sure what the conversion rate is, but that's the same. Uh, classic Silver Mountain Water. This is probably their one of their more popular men's or maybe unisex fragrance, 272, same size bottle. More Creed, we have Adventus, which is their most popular one. 339 for 100 ml. And then a Venice for her, 306. Interesting. And, it, uh, and then again, if you buy both, you say $15. Huh. Bodicea. The Bodicea story. I am not familiar with this brand, but very interesting bottles. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is a lot. Yikes. 8 dollars US for that. It looks like a bottle of very fancy whiskey or scotch. I wish it had the notes in here. Okay, it does have the notes. Some of them don't have the notes. Orange bergamot, orris, rose violet, vanilla. Great. This one is not as expensive. This is $2.11. Ella K. We have, I don't know if I've heard of this. $2.37. Oh, okay. This one. Maze Maison Francis Kirchian, Gentle Fluidity Silver, 187, and then their very popular Baccarat Rouge 540, 250. This is actually a, a great price. I forget what the exact pricing for the size is, but I know that it's a, I feel like it's closer to 300, or maybe over 300. So if you've been waiting to purchase this, now is the time to get it while you're on board Emirates. Hermes Paris, I love these gift sets. I usually get it from Sephora. They actually have the Sephora Savings event coming up soon, and uh, I always recommend their Hermes gift sets. This one in particular is $99 because it's the fuller, bigger sizes of the Jardin Hermes. We have these, 92 I don't remember the prices of these, 132 I feel like that's what the retail is. So you're saving you know, tax, and then you would save the $15 if you buy two. Again, that's just the it would be so great if they had the perfume scent for some of them at least. Maison um, Lancôme. Oh, I've heard of this Oud Bouquet. This is their fancier Lancôme fragrance. How much is this? Oud Bouquet, Eau de Parfum, 100, 218. Okay. I've always been meaning to try that. I don't know if I want to go ahead and invest in a full size. If they had samples, that would be great. And then we have. Idol 114. Did you know Lancôme Idol is the slimmest perfume bottle in the world? Save $15 if you buy two. And then this, I think, is what I will be buying. La Panthère Cartier. I did purchase this recently. The Eau de Toilette from the Cartier Boutique. And this is what I wore on my trip. I have little samples. My mom really liked it, so I'm going to go ahead and buy it for her. However, they don't have the Eau de Toilette version. They only have the Eau de Parfum, so I probably will buy this for me, the Eau de Parfum, and then buy her the Eau de Toilette once we are at the airport and can be going. And uh, we'll go around the airport and I'll find the Eau de Toilette for her and get, that, get her that because she really liked this on me. 136 I think the Eau de Parfum and in the store is... The Eau de Toilette was 144 This, I don't know, maybe was it 175 for the Parfum, Eau de Parfum? Uh, here's the men's... Oh, is this men's? Yeah. Pasha Parfum, 132. 
So that will be one. And then if I get a second one, I will save $15. Givenchy. There's the price. There's the price. Oh, this is a new one. This smells so good. And if I didn't already literally just buy this from Ulta, I would have gotten it here for the $15 off. 109 Dylan Purple. I love the Dylan Turquoise. That's the blue one. And it's very aquatic. This one is uh, more floral, but it's very pretty. And then the classic ones, 70. Oh, both of them. That's pretty good. Okay. Okay. I don't know what these are. I'm trying to hurry it up because my battery is about to die. Amouage. This one I've heard. I have never tried it. It's there's a whole world. These like very niche fragrances. People love them, but I, I just don't know about them. I haven't tried it, so maybe I'll wait to go into the airport and try it out of duty free. Roja perfumes. I've tried some of these. They are very nice. So with the purchase of any Roja parfum, you get the 7.5 ml atomizer worth fifty dollars. It's refillable, so that you, I think you get the empty atomizer. And same thing for men. Travel set. You get this. And then the free atomizer. Tammy London. I have not heard of this brand. 251. Aqua de Parma. 125. I feel like that's pretty much how it is. How much it is uh, just in the States. So you're just saving sales tax. Here's the new Carolina Herrera. Very good girl. Glam. Perfume. 139 for the large size. And then uh, Bulgari Men's Perfume. Or Men's Cologne. 111. Chopard. Very nice. 128. Uh, Narcissa Rodriguez. This actually went viral recently because I think it's one of their newer ones. And I saw a couple videos where people raved about it. But it wasn't available in the States yet. So they were trying to find it in Europe. 135 for the full size. I think that's kind of on par. I've tried their stuff before. It's, it's fine. So that's the new one. YSL. They keep coming out with different flankers. Here's finally the Lip Parfum, Art Parfum, 164. I feel like these aren't much of savings, like 150 for YSL Black Opium. That's very okay. Here we have Penhaligon. I don't own any full-size Penhaligon perfumes, 213, it's kind of pricey. I do have this Discovery set. So the Discovery set here, the Scent Library, they call it, is $32 US. Uh, my discovery set is from a couple years ago, so it might be outdated. And then I think this is a great value. Delina is my favorite fragrance from Parfums de Marly. This full size bottle is two forty six, and these usually retail. It's about two seventy five, close to three hundred. So two forty six, pretty good deal, I think. I don't know this brand, but you get the full size bottle and travel size for two twenty one. We have Issey Mayaki, Issey Mayaki for home, Atkinson's London, never heard of this one, Armani C, 140, see, I mean, I don't really think that's a great savings, Atkinson's, and then we just have your very kind of mainstream, you know, Ralph Lauren, Jean-Paul Gaultier, this one I haven't heard, Quisada for men, okay, and then Prada, this one I just recently got. Luna Rossa Ocean. It smells so good. 106. Again, that's how much it is in the States. It's not, you're not saving anything. We have Mont Blanc, 91. Dunhill, it's $73. John Varvados Artisan. That's pretty, that's like the least expensive one we've seen so far. And I like the bottle. Very cool. And then a classic, Dracar Noir. $36. Wow. That is affordable. Okay, and I have never heard of this. Paloma Picasso, new on board. Paloma Picasso has all the Tiffany designs. I don't, I guess they make perfumes separately now. $25 for 30 ml, so it's kind of like a deluxe travel size. And that was the last of the fragrance. And now we have jewelry. So when I saw this, I said, wow, jewelry. I love jewelry. I've been on a real jewelry kick. And I was so excited when it said fine jewelry, but it is not fine jewelry. These are all costume jewelry. Everything is sterling silver, gold plated, gold vermeil, including this kind of very basic necklace and earrings set. And we have this infinity necklace and earrings set. 
kind of like a ropey tie set for $190. And it's like, okay, $190. I mean, it looks okay. That's, that's what it looks like on. Very pretty, I guess. But $190 for costume jewelry. And these really fancy, silky, strandy necklace and bracelet for $199. Again, 18 karat gold plating of sterling silver. That's the necklace. And then the brand is House of Dietrich. We have more just kind of basic heart costume jewelry. Here we have this nine pack that looks, it's giving Claire's, it's giving icing, $54. Then Scarlet Rose Gold Crystal Jewelry. Wow. That is something. And then this. Is it supposed to be Evil Eye? I don't know. 25. Oh, wait. Let's save 25. Oh, so if you buy both of these, 24.90, 24.89. Okay, so these are the promos where if you buy both, you get something. $25 off. Great. Okay, and then we have Swarovski. There was actually a Swarovski store at the JFK Terminal. And they have this, I actually have this Evil Eye Bangle set. And they have the charm bracelet with a slider clasp for 106, which I think is pretty much the same price. Swan pendant necklace for 79. They're really pushing their swan. That's their mascot. I'm not, I mean, if that's your spirit animal, you know, you do you. The deluxe bracelet, I own this one. I really like it for costume jewelry. I like that it has the separate removable link if you needed to make it shorter. So mine, I have mine removed, so it just connects these two. And earrings, maybe seven. Okay, here's an interesting brand. It's Ceruti 1881, and they have this design, which I don't know the name because I'm not familiar as much with Bulgari jewelry, but they have this design. It's like Diva or Divine. <laughs> I forget what it's actually called, but it's this shape, same shape, same color, white. We have the pendant earrings, jewelry set, 135. And then the bangle, I've seen this because typically a lot of women who <laughs> stack Cartier jewelry, they'll stack it with a Van Cleef bracelet and a Bulgari bracelet with this similar design, but this is not fine jewelry. It is custom jewelry for $80 for this bangle. For your Armani bracelet, $99. And then if you're into the Evil Eye, we have this guy for $59. For and then this copper slab, um, copper turquoise slab necklace for $99. And then this kind of caught my eye right, because it reminds me of David Yerman, the cable bracelets with the you know jewel tips. $99 for the set. Obviously it's custom jewelry also in the rose and silver and yellow gold. I like this design because I would wear this on my left hand next to my watch so that it doesn't scratch the bezel or the crown or whatever it's called. This one also caught my eye. This is Buckley London because what does it remind you of? This reminds me of the Cartier Trinity collection with the rose gold, yellow gold, white gold. Again, costume jewelry. We have 146 for the sparkle set. So all three, 146. I'm very curious what it looks like. I'm wondering if I can see it because maybe I'll pick it up. Who knows? 10% off of 146. This, you know, XL bracelets, set of three, 47, another earring pack, <laughs> $32. Very, uh, I don't know, Buckley London. What is this? Another set, beloved set. Okay, each one spells love, $99. Oh, I see. The bracelet, a necklace, pendant, and the earrings. Okay, that's really trying hard to spell love. Okay, sure. Exit pendant, bangle set, 125. This is just like, I don't know, whatever. Natural diamonds, really? 229 onyx. Here we have Carl Lagerfeld with his cat set for 164. This is cute. I've never heard of this brand. Square Gear Cuffling 216. If you um, are an engineer, you might like this. We just like gears and cogs. I wonder if it moves, uh, which 
to rotate by touch, huh? So it's open? That's weird. Bracelet set, whatever. Uh, okay, we have uh, Tahitian pearls. Natural Tahitian dark pearl 99. You have that rainbowish Tahitian pearl. And now we have beauty, deodorant, makeup, skincare. We have, these are kind of whatever. It feels like the Hermes of skincare. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what is this? I've never heard of this. Definitive enzyme cleaner. Oh, that's the brand. Latour. Eh. Augustinus Bader. This is their popular, the Rich Cream 216. I'm not sure what the retail price is. And then some skin tools. More stuff. Skin care. Skin care stuff. Heels. We have the serum. Again, if you can compare it to the original price, if it's a good deal, then okay. If you like this stuff. I actually do use this. I'm going through a trial size right now with the ultra, ultra facial cream. If they had the eye cream, that would have been great. These I actually really like. The L'Occitane hand set. 51 for this set. One, two, three, four, five, six. Individually boxed for gifting. Great. Elizabeth Arden. And then, I've never heard of this brand. June Cell. 80 for this set. I need to do some research on that brand. Clarins. I, oh, by the way, speaking of Clarins. I thought it was pronounced Clarins. Apparently it's pronounced Claron. But they have their double serum which I use, and then the Lip Comfort Oil. I love their Lip Comfort Oils. You get a pack of three for 57, which is pretty good because I think individually they retail for 24. More Claron, Babor, I've used their stuff before. And more stuff, Estelle and Teald, Shiseido, Herborean. That's a big Korean uh, skincare brand, Shiseido. Oh, this is a good uh, stick SPF, SPF 50, $36. And then my mom wants me to get her this, so I'm gonna go ahead and order this for her in addition to the fragrances. The uh, multi-purpose dry oil for your hair and body, $33 for 100 ml. That's okay, I'll get it. And then I don't know this brand, Jet Cosmetics, J oh, sorry, Jet, JFT, sorry. <laughs> Paris, okay. It's like a K-Beauty brand. Don't know this one. Margaret Davos. I guess that's her. Okay. Oh, she's an OBE. Do you guys watch Kiki Blinders? He got an OBE. <laughs> okay. Oh, and here we have Makeup Benefit. Classic. Ooh, moisturizing lip balm. 54 for the trio. Browsing. Here's another promo. If you buy both of these, you save an additional... $15. And then more makeup. I actually really like these all-in-one palettes. Great for quick touch-ups. Soft glam eyeshadow palette. I mean, that's the price. That's the price at Ulta. I don't know. I, unless, I guess if you just went on board an airplane and didn't bring anything with you, this is a great place to prep for your destination. But otherwise, this is just very whatever. Liquid blush, $36. I mean, no savings at all at this point. So, and I guess that's pretty much it. Then sunglasses. Yeah, I would need to try these. Ray-Bans. I don't know. Folding glasses, okay. <laughs> Sleep bracelet. Another pair of folding. Wait, what? Oh my gosh. Interesting. <laughs> Sun, oh, it's the cover. Accessory that protects your sunglasses from scratches and dust. Adding a sophisticated touch. I don't know about that. Is that a sophisticated touch? It looks like an owl and then it's just hanging off wherever you... <laughs> That's not sophisticated touch to me. $80 just for this case that hangs from your bag. And then a bag, I don't know. 164. A smart wallet. And if you need a tote handbag, we have this one, oh, two ninety five. Uh, you get a long shop at that point. More smart wallets, smart wallets, smart wallet. For men who just come onto a plane with their cards and their keys and their car money in their pocket with no wallet, you can pick one up here on the Emirates flight. These are actually useful. The electronics, great. 
and then more electronics, toothbrush. If the free toothbrush was not sufficient, you could buy an electric toothbrush, mosquito repellent cream, more, more stuff. Comfort. Oh, actually, I need this digital luggage scale, twenty-one dollars. Huh. I had a luggage scale from Amazon, but I lost it during my last trip. <laughs> And then just whatever, more electronics, mini projector, yes. Like, who comes on board and is like, I need a mini projector, and I cannot wait until I get off the plane. Unless you're literally going for work and you're doing a presentation and you're like, oops, I forgot to pack my mini projector. <laughs> Thank God they have it on the plane. Mm, electronic, electronic. Uh, these are useful. I have them already, air tags. And then that is it. And then we have young travelers. These are cute for your, your little ones. We have a smartwatch for $51. Harry Potter bracelet, $31. And the kids' sunglasses. And that is it, you guys. That is everything that you can buy while you are on board your Emirates A380 flight to Dubai from JFK. So I will um, follow up with my order and I will let you know what I ended up picking up. But they do come to you, come to your seat, you place your order and they deliver it to you. They don't wait and give it to you at the gate the way you would with duty-free shopping at the airport terminal. You order it from your seat and then they deliver it to your seat. So I think that's pretty cool. So I'll let you know if I end up getting anything. Thank you.